Yeah, good afternoon YouTube. So I have my little uh, 12 volt lithium polymer battery and my solar powered work light here. This battery pack is real handy. It's got both a male and female power jacks and plugs on it. And I'm just setting up this, this is a shelf going in my workshop area. And I'm putting some LED strip lights underneath and I had to do a little solder connection up at the end and this battery is great for testing. It's hard to bring the shelf to a power supply and I wanted to test the shelf before I put it up and connected it to power so there we go. Yeah so there I've got my shelf set up right above my little workbench area so main idea is I want to get this stuff up on the shelf now so I can have some more workbench room. Now I got my lights, a little bit of under shelf lighting there. From uh, my eye position you can't see the lead strip so that's all good and even from down below they start to show up a little bit. Just got them powered off my bench power supply right now. So I've got an outlet strip up above and then I can uh, power all my various equipment up there off of that outlet strip and get rid of all the power cords running down the wall. Yeah, YouTube, here's my under cabinet lighting fixture that I'm making up. So this is uh, three strips of single density LED strip light. My cabinets are about 20 inches wide, so I cut a piece of uh, inch and a half PVC angle that I had around. I sprayed the inside with a little silver paint for a little better reflection and then the outside is painted black. So I have the three strips of lights and then I'll show you what the uh, light looks like. Here's actually one installed right there. Just got the three strips. There's a little uh, jumper on one end and then a jumper on the other end. So I'll have to run the uh, I'll run my wires down here to the back because this is where the hinge is so the cabinets hinge out from the center and then I'll have to bring this one there'll be a light in here and then the wire runs back to the hinge and then across here and then I'll join the two together over there yeah YouTube so here's the finished uh, under cabinet lighting and then I have the under shelf lighting and I'll flip on the power and there we go that worked out pretty good. It's four feet, three 16 inch pieces here. Same over on this one. And then under the main shelf there are two four foot lengths. So that's a total of 16 feet or five meters of strip light. And we've got about 20 watts. So it's 12 volts and 1.6 amps according to the power supply. Yeah, I just wanted to show you the finished under cabinet lights and then the under shelf lighting. So I think that came out pretty good. I'll have to get the uh, white balance set for that so everything will look natural. But I think I have 4000 Kelvin both on the magnifying light and on the under shelf and under cabinet light. So at least all the color temperatures are consistent. Just wanted to show you what it looked like a finished project. So. If you have any uh, questions about that, put that in the comments section below. You can check out my channel for some of my other LED lighting videos. And as always, thanks for watching.